Okay. It's Tom, and I'm back again with more Sugar Britches demos featuring the Sugar Britches crossover blend pedal, which I make. And today, the Red Panda particle pe pedal, pedal, which I do not make. Uh, and it's a really cool pedal that does one or two cool things and a whole bunch of things that I'm not really sure what you would do with them. But I've got it here. Um, together with my uh, lovely assistant, the Fender Dimension HH bass, which is, unlike every other bass I own, completely stock. With also slightly dead flat uh, round wounds. I guess that's my thing this year is... Uh, well, I'm not playing anywhere, so why would I put new strings on, right? <laughs> Let's use both pickups. Since it has two, I guess that's kind of its feature, right? Flatten it out. And bump the treble a little because the strings are half dead. And yeah, that's what it does best. It is a fender after all. Alright, so let's turn on the particle here. Um, on. And uh, it's got four presets, which are mostly set to sort of chorusing kind of thing. And it does a weird... What would you call that? It's fracturing of the sound. Which kind of makes me think this is something that... Jimi Hendrix probably would have liked is the weird sort of it's like like a like a Leslie speaker only more random yeah this is the pitch shifting setting isn't it so you can get it doing strange things and it'll just hold the note forever. <laughs> it just, yeah, glitch pedals can be interesting, but for as a basic straightforward effect, like a um, randomly detuned delay, it also has its own uses. And um, I guess where Sugar Bridges comes into this again is because it is a time-based effect, and especially for the delays. You don't really want that going on forever in the very bottom of the bass. Not usually, because it'll mud up everything. In fact, you probably don't want that happening at all unless you're playing something really weird and experimental or pretty much any normal psychedelic music and you're bored. So yeah, it's very much an effect pedal. Not, uh, not kind of like your just general color, but it's you can do some pretty crazy things, or basically just kind of sp splattered chorusing. Where it does shine is when you combine it with another pedal. Well, it always shines a little bit, but gently. Uh, so maybe I'll combine it with another pedal here. Um, eh, I don't know. I'll do another video, and then we'll come back to this. Bye-bye. <laughs>